Hey Panthers. Panthers! My name's Sierra. And I'm Desiree. And for today's Panther News is Jostens will be here next Thursday for all seniors. And the kindest challenges for next week are... On Sunday, Stargazing Sunday, spend quality time with your friends. Positivity Monday, come to the stage and leave a positive message. Tell a joke Tuesday, make someone laugh. Boo your friends, write a note at lunch for Wednesday. Thank a staff member Thursday. Flashback Friday, thank a former teacher. And South Care Saturday, spoil yourself. Friday morning football, next Friday. So at five in the morning, channel 30 will come and make sure to come support in the gym and make sure to show your spirit on the name. So I hope you have, guys have a good third period and have a good day today and make sure to come join Purple Jungle and it will be really fun. And the game after that, senior night, we are going to have Pink Potter. So make sure to come early to get your Pink Potter. And tell us, I mean, it's a big game too. It's a pink out game to support breast cancer, right? Uh, yeah, I, I didn't really hear you with them, yo. I know, they're cheering so loud. They're really pumped over tonight's game. Um, anything that you'd like to say to the community for them to come out? Um, it's just big for us. Uh, if you guys can come out and support us, we're the only home game in town tonight. So come on out and support the Panthers. All right, let's have you guys open up some space so we can get all the rest of the crowd. As you guys can see, obviously, the cheerleaders always back there. Everyone's here. All right, let's open up some space right here. Let's go through. Obviously, these are all the football players. We got all the school over here. Everyone very excited for a big game. And let me tell you something. They're going to win tonight. All the school spirit, all the signs. I mean, I'm getting lost in the crowd because these kids are just really excited and riled up. So it's going to be a big game. All right, guys, I'm going to send it back to you guys because here at Pacheco High School, there is so much school spirit, so much energy, and obviously, as you can hear, the band is doing an amazing job. All right, we're going to send it back to you guys. This is a 47 matchup. Morning Panthers, I'm Diamond and this is Chef Rat. And today we're going to be asking him some questions. So, how long have you been teaching? <laughs> This is my second year teaching. Actually, it'd probably be my first year mm -hmm. since last year was all online, but this is a whole new experience for me. Um, so basically, this is probably my first year teaching uh, real classes. Oh, nice. And what do you teach exactly? I teach culinary arts here at uh, Pacheco. So um, you can find me in K-19. K-19. If you want to have some good food, have some good times, and uh, just have an all around just great time here. Uh, find us at K19. We'll do, do some really good, uh, good food here. Yep. And a lot of cool stuff. Yep. Um, you have any favorite hobbies? I have hobbies. Yeah, cooking is one of them. Obviously, mm -hmm. um, I love watching sports on the weekends. I love going golfing, being outside, mm -hmm. uh, spending time with my family and friends. Yep. So do you mind sharing uh, where you went to school? So I went to culinary school at the Institute of Technology in Modesto, California. Um, I did that for, it was a 10 month program and I did an externship at an Italian restaurant in Turlock. And then shortly after that, I got my first uh, full-time restaurant gig in Modesto. Oh, nice. Um, do you have any pets? I do have a pet. I got a dog, a golden doodle, a mini golden doodle wow. named Bailey. She's oh. quite the handful. Nice. <laughs> and uh, last question, what's your favorite football team? 49ers, baby, let's yeah. go! Thank you, Chef Mike, and make sure you guys stop by K19 and see if he's cooking up something great. And uh, we'll see you later, Panther. See ya. Hi, my name is Carly Jimenez, and today we're here with. I am Miss Stone Grove. And what's your club? I help out with the Black Student Union. Ms. Cooksey and I are advisors for the Black Student Union on campus. Mm -hmm. So what is your goal in this club? So the goals of the club are about promoting black culture, educating people about black history, um, learning about important civil rights issues. Mm, that's super nice. Um, what do you, when do you guys meet up? What day? We meet every Wednesday and now that we have two lunches, we meet in my classroom B13 during first lunch. And during second lunch, the big gym with Miss Cooksey. Oh, yeah, second lunch is kind of ruined it. Um, what's your favorite thing about this club? 
My favorite thing about the club are the students in the club. Um, last year was a little difficult because we were online for most of the year, so it's really nice to have students back in person. And so far we have a, a lot of interest and participation in the club. Would you like to say anything about your club? And your Join our club. We are. Hi, look. What, what is, is that? that? Multicultural night. Never been to one. Have you? I've never heard about it. Heard about it. You guys never heard of multicultural night? Are no, you guys serious? Never. No, come here. Come here. Let's go. Come, come here. What is it? Multicultural night is on October 21st. What time is it? It's from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m., guys. Why come should on. I go? Why should you go? Multicultural night represents all different types of cultures, like Japanese cultures, Polynesian cultures all types of cultures like that. And you guys would love to see the, these tables that we have examples of it, everything like that. What kind of food is there gonna be? Did somebody say food? Cause I know y'all just hungry as I am. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of food vendors there. So you guys can try different types of cultured food, um, like tortillas, you know, stuff like that. <laughs> Some easy stuff. Is there really gonna be performers? Yes, there is gonna be performers actually. There's gonna be a big list of performers. We have our Aztec dancers, Polynesian dancers, we have our bandas, we have all kinds of different stuff like that. Is so we should go? Yes, of course you guys should go. Why wouldn't you want to go? Is it's it free such to a go? Good event. I'm glad you guys asked because I know you like free just as we like free here. Yeah, yes, yeah. it is a free event. Everyone is welcome. So we do really do encourage you to come on by for our multicultural night on October 21st. Oh, okay, guys, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We're going to go. We're going. Hi Panthers, I'm here in the cafeteria interviewing one of our cafeteria lunch ladies. What is your name? Tish. Go Tish! <laughs> <laughs> what are you in charge of here in the cafeteria? Making sure our kids get fed. Come mm. get food in the cafeteria. <laughs> Tish will hook you up. Yep. Um, how long have you been working here at Pacheco? This will be my 21st. Oh, Pacheco? Eight, eight and a half years. How's your experience so far? Good. And last question, what is your favorite football team? 49ers, of course. Uh, 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 Thank you, Tish. You're welcome. Hey, Panthers. So for this week's Panther Wishes, we have two to give out to. For our next Panther Wish, we have for Emma, and she wished for some Panther gear. So we're going to go give it to her right now. Okay, someone had a Panther Wish, and it's for Emma. She wished for Panther gear. So for one of the Panther Wishes, we're going to be giving out a gift to Kristen Kian. We have a Panther Wish today, and his name is Kristen Kian. <laughs> and he wished for a dollar. Oh, I did write a dollar. Thank you. You're welcome. I got a dollar. que hacemos cada noche como fe cultural para explorar que unes a los humanos a través de culturales, edades y lugares. Las personas responden y envían sus selfies a través de las redes sociales, el correo electrónico o online. Los invitamos que pregunten, que respondan esta pregunta. ¿Qué une a los humanos a través de culturales, edades y lugares? Adiós. Adiós. <laughs> We are one. We are one is a social experiment we do every multicultural night to explore what unites humans across the countries, ages, and places. People will answer and submit their selfies via social media, email, and remind. Text 81010 at VOSPHS. What's up, guys? We're inviting people to answer the multicultural night question. The question is What unites humans across the ages, cultures, and places? I'm Jalissa and I'm here with Essie. And the question that I'm going to be asking her is what unites humans across cultures, ages, and places? Um, I say social media because like the people can reach out to their family and friends across the globe and around the world and they can stay in contact and have fun, live lives. Hey guys, I'm Anna and I'm here with Leslie and she's going to be answering our multicultural night question. And the question is what unites humans across cultures, ages, and places? 
I think music does because it brings everyone joy and it makes everyone happy. What's up, guys? I'm Ian. I'm here with Mr. Marchoki, Mr. M. Now, I'm asking the multi culture night questions. The question is, what unites humans across the cultures, ages, and places? Yeah, well, as uh, so we've all heard, uh, the United States is a true melting pot with cultures and um, people from all over the world that have come and continue to come to this great country. And uh, it's more important now than ever that we embrace each other's cultures because all of those add to what it truly means to be uh, an American. Last week, our varsity boys football team took on Grace Davis and was defeated 34-21. Here are some clips from the game. This week was very busy for Pacheco Athletics. Volleyball took on Grace Davis home and all three levels won. Golf also ended up beating Johansson and Davis. And as of water polo, both boys and girls lost to LB and Johansson, and girls tennis lost to Lathrop. Make sure to support your football team tonight as they take on series at home, and make sure to show some support to your volleyball team as they take on your crosstown rivals, Tigers. We're gonna party till we're purple. Yeah, I love being purple.